Welcome to the Michigan Golfer Show. Join us each week as we explore the people, the places, and the events that shape our great game. It's a beautiful spring day at the Pete Dye Course at French Lick, Indiana. And with us is Steve Ferguson, who's the visionary behind all this wonderful stuff we're seeing today. How are you doing? Well, I couldn't, I actually couldn't be better, but my knee is recovering slowly, so I can't play today. They haven't released me to play. But as you say, I, you couldn't ask for a better day than this is. And the sun's shining, no breeze, it's just, it's perfect. Less wind than yesterday, I think, so. Yeah, it's always windy up here, but later in the afternoon, the wind will, it will pick up, yeah. Well, almost 10 years ago, you laid out a vision for what the Peak Dye Course and the renovation of the hotel in West Baden and all the changes that have happened, what it was going to be, and it's, it's happened. What do you think about that? Well, we're actually, extremely pleased uh, and proud. I think the impact on the community, if you just look 10 years ago versus now, the, the new buildings, the structure, um, the impact it's had on, you know, 1,700 employees just from this area. Uh, and that's really, uh, that's really everybody. Really nice. You know, that's, that's one of the most significant things is the impact you have on people because now they can find a job. And I just last night, as I was coming through and the, one of the young hostess there and I hadn't met her before and introduced myself and chatted with her, asked her where she was from and she was from French Lick, you know, and 10 years ago, she wouldn't have been able to find a job here in French Lick. And a uh, nice young lady, I hope that she uses some of our programs that are available and money to go to college and do some other things too. But uh, it, it, I think that's really the satisfaction. Um, and most fascinating but most satisfying uh, part of it. And with the tournaments, even more people are discovering this wonderful place. So that's pretty exciting too. Well, obviously the tournaments, anytime you're involved in something that's a first of a kind, uh, I think this restoration is, it was, it was number one in the history of the United States. And um, to have the first senior women's uh, uh, tournament championship is uh, that's really special too and to be you know how many times in a lifetime do you get to be involved in something that's first of, a, of, a, of its kind 
Yeah, the, the golf is really special for everybody that's here today, but some of us also are just bowled over by the restoration. Um, can you talk a little bit about restoring the hotel? Well, you know, uh, it, uh, the West Main Hotel was just uh, part of it had collapsed and was ready to collapse, and so uh, we had to put a, a whole steel structure in it, and so it, that was tough. You know, if you build a, a building from scratch and you put up a steel structure, it's sort of like an erector set. But when you do it and every piece of steel has to be cut, uh, and so that turned in what we thought would be a $5 million to a $35 million project. And then everything grew, and we grew from saying, well, we're going to put $5 million in it to putting $500 million in it. it just a little cost overrun on the way. Uh, but I, I think when people look at it, they can see the $500 million. Oh, absolutely we can. And it's uh, wonderful to stay there, and we really appreciate everything you've done, not just for this area and French Lick and West Baden, but for golf and people who appreciate those things. Well, thanks for coming. We really enjoy having people up. Uh, we really enjoy, uh, you know, that was one of the things we wanted to do was have it uh, lived in and used as it had originally, and that's turned out really well, and things like this, and the fact that you came up here is uh, to send the message, because we want people to come and enjoy this magnificent uh, structure. And we hope you get out on the course very soon. Well, they said another three or four weeks. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm pretty sore today, but I'll... The season. Yeah, that's right. So, so I'm planning on being out there. As soon as they say yes, I'll be there. Thank you for talking. Thank you. Thank you.